Hey, Surveys, welcome back to K Pop Schools. I'm Paige. I'm Kate. And we are back, guys. We're super excited. We just got done checking out our boy Ravi and his song Winner um, featuring Ash Island. That was amazing. It was. Such a good song. Such an amazing collab. Like I said, uh, go check that out. That'll be up. Um, actually, before, after that video, um, we did a separate album unboxing so that'll be up after that one but um now we're heading into our like one of our favorite groups probably BTS. one of our favorite probably alt groups yeah spots. <laughs> they're in our olds at this point in time um our boys ats so this actually came out uh, a couple weeks ago um i think like two weeks ago the short version did yeah and then it's like why don't you just release the official yeah. solo music video not the short because it came video. out on universe um which a lot of groups are doing that um i think your account wants to go out so i'm gonna let him out really okay quick. yeah you can keep talking yeah so unfortunately um with that with the don't stop music video when they first dropped it a couple weeks ago um they only dropped the short version um you might have to open my brother's store to let him out um but um because it was a short version um we didn't want to check out the short version um just because it's not fun for us if we're only doing a minute long thing and it's not fun for you guys to only get a teaser and be like meh so we wanted to wait and see if they would drop the full version which they finally did about four days ago and then we weren't able to get together until now so but now we're here super excited um like i said for those of you who have not seen any of our 80s content which is kind of crazy if you've been on our channel for any length of time but if you're new to the channel and you haven't seen any of our ATs content, um, Yoon Ho has become not only my bias, um, but he is my ult bias in ATs. <laughs> he is just sword past. Like, he's been biased since, like, day one, but he's just become ult status at this point because that boy is just... <sighs> he's, he's, he's just an issue for you. All the time. Um, her bias is, is Sunghua. Sunghua. He was my original wrecker. Um, but both of our records are now your song. Yeah, we share a record for this group. <laughs> we do. He has become, a, a, a just a problem all the time. He's just always catching our eye. He's always <laughs> causing issues. So we're like, your song. <laughs> so yeah, we've kind of made that official. Um, but the rest of the boys all attack us in many ways. San is always a problem. Uyung, I always have to tell him to keep his tongue in his mouth. Just as bad as Song was sometimes. Mm -hmm. um, Hong Joon is king. Freaking Mingyu's deep freaking voice. Love it. Jung Ho's beautiful vocals. Like, oh, this whole group is just on a whole other level. And like I said, they got even better through Kingdom. Like, we didn't think they could get better, but they did. Um... So yeah, super excited to hop into this one, guys. Uh, before we do, we'll leave a link to our Patreon down below in the description box so you can come over and check us out. Uh, we do live stages, drum reactions, variety shows, dance practices. You can join our Discord. Basically, everything you can't do here on YouTube. We also post free videos over there for you guys to get blocked on our channel because we're not going to make you pay for things to give you free. That's just stupid. Speaking of our Patreon, we're currently watching Rome BTS Island. Uh, we will be starting Produce 101 very soon since we have finished Kingdom. The Isaacs, Strong with Dobong Soon, Got Seven's Hard Carry, uh, Got Seven's Dream Night, and I have my own segment called Pint Size where I react to dramas on my own. Currently, I am watching the drama Doom at Your Service. The first episode is available for free for you guys, and if you enjoy my reaction, you can join our $5 tier to get the rest of the episodes. Um, also, speaking of that Pint Size segment, after I finish Doom at Your Service, which I only have like four or five episodes left, I will be starting the drama Imitation, which you guys voted for. Um, so, super excited to check that one out. We got a ton of fun stuff going on over there. We'll also be starting some um, album listening soon as well. Um, and also, if you want to follow us over on Twitter, our handle will be on uh, screen as well. Um, we post every single day over there what video is dropping, so you guys can stay up to date what we're doing here on our channel. All right, are you ready? I'm ready. Super excited. Unfortunately, there are no captions for this video, but that is okay. That's just life from International Stan, and it's on, like, every universe video never has captions, so it's okay. We understand. Um, by the way, just a little heads up, too, because I've noticed it's getting worse since we've been talking <laughs> longer. I'm still... I've had, like, a weird cold on and off for, like, over a month, um, and so my throat sounds extremely scratchy today because I've been coughing nonstop the past two days. Some juicy coughs. <clears throat> yeah, some juicy coughs, you know, those big robust, like, oh, those coughs, um, and my nose is a little stuffed, so if I sound a little off and scratchiness, that's what that is, and I do apologize for it. Anyway, moving on to our boys who we absolutely adore, ATs Don't Stop. No KQ intro. Nope. Just going right in. Ooh, I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit. 
Ooh. Got some auto tuning. Ooh. <laughs> this is. I feel like it's gonna be like story based. It seems like it. Ooh. He was abandoned. This Can't sounds so good. Money. See Sunny for money. The bra oh, the oh, Blondie and Ho. I love Blondie and Ho so much. <laughs> He looked way too good. Oh, Hong Joon. Vocals. Oh, Mingi. They left him. Oh, Mingi looks like he's gonna kill somebody. <gasps> he blew up the car. Oh, Zan. <laughs> They're playing poker with some dude. Why does Son look? Okay, hi yo song with the leather jacket. I see you. <laughs> Please unload gun and remove ski mask before entering. Did you see that sign? Yeah. What is happening? I think they're criminals, but that's all I get. Well, I mean, they are pirates, so it makes sense. This is so different. It looks like they found um, like a, it's a magic tricks out here. I don't know what the word is. It's not a telescope. Uh. I mean, it is a telescope. I mean, kind of, but also like, there's a certain word for it. Uh, destiny ship. What is going on? Are they trying to find a ship? Maybe. Don't burn it. That's a really nice place. Ooh. Bang Jung, you arsonist. This song and sound is so different. But it's still them. Yeah. <gasps> oh no! You dummy. He got the sparks on his face. Oh no! There's a key. Ooh, John Oh, <gasps> That's... <laughs> The, the performance from Icon, the, the Icon Rhythm Top performance when they're in the car, periscope, telescope. I don't know. Periscope <gasps> sounds right, honestly, but I'm not 100 percent sure. Them in the oh, Songwa. <laughs> no song. He's wearing studs. <gasps> oh no! What happened to your eye? See, I saw him posting pictures wearing that. I was like, what is going on? Captain's here. Songwa, we don't know. Collect your man. The way he hopped off the fucking car like that, like. <laughs> they got a bunch of money. The pirate. <laughs> they got the ship. They found it. So it's is this a really like a weird place for a ship to be, though? So is this like the prequel to them becoming pirates? It seems like it. Like I said, well, remember the Icon performance, the Rhythm Tower performance? Um, they said it was the prequel to Wonderland, so it was the prequel to them becoming mm -hmm. pirates. It's how they became. So this would make sense that this was, like, the prequel. What is going on? <laughs> and now they're just being chaotic. As they are. It's like they're partying in the ship, almost. Oh, that's awesome. But I can't really tell, because I can't really see. I'm just, like... I'm in awe. <laughs> First off, the song was catchy. Like but honestly, I found myself focusing more on the video than listening right. to the song. Like I said, I was listening to it, but uh, like without the lyrics too. Like it's, and it seemed more of a low key song too. So mm. it was, it felt more like background music to the story, than anything. Obviously, I'm definitely gonna have. We're gonna have to look at. Um, we actually can do that right in this video. We can look up the lyrics, like a lyric video for it. Um, I definitely want to check out a lyric video. Um. lyrics there it is okay um but yeah but b before we do um the lyric video um one second let's go through this ad here why just brush to clean uh because it's necessary gotta love these ads guys and we'll continue in a second i just want to get through this so i can pause and okay <clears throat> so 
let's just before we get into the actual lyrics let's talk about the video itself first um first off that was a lot it was very very heavy storyline um there's elements of them like i said from kingdom showing like the whole prequel where they were like the rhythm tower it said that they were becoming the pirates um, it was like the prequel to Wonderland, like with the, them in the van and then them breaking through the wall. That was literally the start of that rhythm top performance. Um, them being thieves and kind of breaking into stuff. Yeah, it's almost like they needed to steal stuff and money so that they could like fund their, fund their pirate yeah, adventure. Yeah, the trip. Yeah, their pirates. And then literally Hong Jun's like having, like maybe it was his ship to begin with and he lost it. Cause maybe. It, you know what's weird about it? The way San and Uyang were, I mean, obviously they were cheating cause like that's, Pirates do that all the time, but they were playing I'd be poker. Too. I don't know how to play poker. I don't, <laughs> I don't know, but um, it almost looked like they were playing to get something back, because mm-hmm. maybe like in my brain, because theory brain, um, maybe originally why Hong Jun was so pissed and he was like looking at the model of the ship was that he lost his ship in a poker game, mm-hmm. and that's to why that they were, yeah to that dude, and that's why they were playing to get it back. Like the telescope, they had lost aspects of it and so in order to get it back they had to play for it and they know that they had to cheat to win and then you notice too when he broke the ship a key fell out yeah it was almost like oh and on top of that that pirate scope thing um yeah it's a telescope that's the only thing i can think of (laughs) periscope or telescope and periscopes are more for like uh submarines not so telescope would be the only thing i can think of i don't think it's a telescope (laughs) <clears throat> but um spyglass that's what it's uh, called spyglass <laughs> literally the same thing it's telescope spyglass <laughs> but um we're dumb <laughs> we're like what the hell is this word um but the way he was getting was super angry and like he threw it and like the sparks came up because of the fire into his mm-hmm. eye and then that's how he gets a pirate eye patch so it's like oh we see like the origin like this kind of plays into the whole rhythm tile like prequel like origin mm-hmm. stories of how they become pirates um, and how they have, like, holidays and all that. Um, it was really interesting. And obviously, like I said, I've seen Blonde Yunho before. So, like, that wasn't what was shocking. What was shocking was how good he looked <laughs> with the blonde. It was blonde. really nice. <laughs> right? I'm like, And the, you were definitely right when you said that black hair Hongjun was superior. Right? <laughs> I was like... I don't, like, like I said, I've seen, we've seen Hongjun in a couple different colors, like, blue-haired Hongjun is gorgeous, but black-haired Hongjun, something about black-haired Hongjun is just superior, he just looks so damn good, <laughs> but, um, I really loved how, like, we, we've seen them kind of get immersed in stories before, obviously, they, they mm-hmm. always kind of immerse themselves in characters, but I felt like they went beyond here, like, they were fully immersed like, they're, that, especially at the end, they're like, Songwa? Holy fuck. When he jumped down, he's like, yeah, I'm a badass. I have never seen Sony look so hot and so aggressive getting off a vehicle before. <laughs> like, they were just sitting there and he's like, Because usually people boom. just kind of, like, stumble. Right, and he's like, smoothly just jumps down, like, badass, walks over to Hong Jun and throws it down. I'm like, this man. <laughs> <laughs> like, I was like, come collect your mans. Like, he is getting out of control. <sighs> but, um, and then Mingi, too, just the way, like, when he got out of the, like, was, like, left out of the car and he starts walking away and he's just staring at the camera, he looked ready to kill. And then, like, two seconds later, he explodes the car fucking behind him. <laughs> I'm like, holy fuck. Like, maybe there was someone in there. <laughs> right, like, don't fuck with Mingi. <laughs> It'll go off. He will blow you up. <laughs> Um, San and Mingi, or er, San and Uyang, um, had a really interesting dynamic, like, you can see, like, they're, like, playing off each other, helping each other cheat, like, Uyang throw in, like, they're doing, like, magic tricks with the cards, or throw in, uh, the ace to San there so he can play it, like, that was so cool. Jong Ho, I think it was Jong Ho, you know, or, like, the ones kind of being close to each other, uh, Sangwa and Yo Sang, Yo Sang looks so good with that black leather mm-hmm. jacket. With the studs on the collar. Yeah. Yeah. They all look so good. Uh, Hong Jun with that long trench coat. Um, like like I said, black hair is superior on him. So he, him with the styling of this hair, plus the... Like, he fully was in, like embodying captain vibes. Like, you could tell he was like, he is the captain of the ship. Don't fuck with him. Songwa was literally giving off first mate vibes. Like, 
I love this so much. We but, gotta go through sometime and give them all positions. Yes, like, literally. Um, so enough about that. Like, that was just a full video we went through, but now let's uh, actually take a look at this. Listen to the song now without the visuals so we can actually pay attention to the song and hear some lyrics, for, or check out some lyrics. So here we go. And once again, AT says, don't stop. Oh, so he starts off the song. I was wondering who's doing it. It sounds so good. This auto tune. <laughs> oh. Song walk. Jesus. Oh, Yasa. Yo Sung and San are joining the rap line. All right, they're all the all the vocals, <laughs> and then of course John has beautiful vocals. <laughs> you know, got a lot of lines in this. Yeah. Don't stop. So it seems like they're fighting Like at first it seems like almost fighting against instinct But now they're like it's okay don't fight it Just yeah. just go for it Follow it Yeah Rhythm top. <laughs> the way he said, I love it, I like it. Yeah, it's like, just keep going, like, it's almost like saying, it's not enough, you have to keep going. Yeah, pretty much. It's like, so that no one can stop us, yeah. Fuck, this- <laughs> Getting drunk on the rhythm, getting, getting drunk on the sound, crazy. yeah. All your songs go to Cordis part. Get a your song. See, now that we listen to it a second time, just fully the song, I'm feeling the song way more. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I already liked the song, but I was so focused on the visuals and the storyline that I'm like, I definitely needed to check out the lyrics and the full song again. And we can actually understand. I didn't want it to be over. over. I didn't want it to be over. Okay. And then it's like 40 seconds of nothingness. Why do you add 40 seconds of nothingness? It's for copyright reasons and for, um, some people plug other stuff, but it's mainly some for copyright put reasons. Some people music yeah. at the end to claim yeah. music on the video. Yeah, it's mostly for copyright reasons. So yeah, I have a much better understanding, I think, now. Um, it's mm -hmm. basically them, like, saying, um, and obviously we, combined with the visuals of what we were seeing, it makes more sense. Um, like, don't stop, keep going, like, it's not enough, like, them keep saying, your yeah, th them literally, like, even if it's world domination, <laughs> they're like, it's not enough for them to steal, it's not enough for them to, like, we gotta keep going, it's, this isn't where we're meant to be, we gotta, like, push further, it's not, you know, we're not there mm -hmm. yet, like, it's kind of definitely something along that, and it's like, no matter how much you're sweating, no matter, like, it's not enough, you gotta keep going, just get crazier, go, 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 like, I really like that, <laughs> and like I said, I have a much higher I mean, I like the song, but... But hearing it a second time, it just mm -hmm. really cements how much you like it. Yeah, like, I have a much better appreciation of the full, like, lyricism and the instrumentals and how they did the song. Um, we actually had a lot of Yosang in there, a lot of mm -hmm. Yunho. Like, I, I love that. This was Yunho's era. And Jungho. Yeah. Um, I actually feel like, um, vocal line-wise, I mean, 
even rap line, obviously, because, I mean, there are eight members, but I feel like this is honestly one of those songs where it has pretty it's even more, to me, line kinda, distribution, yeah. almost. Yeah, like, almost, like, very, very even compared to others, you know, normally. Um, I feel like it has a very, like, really well done line distribution on this, so it, it was a phenomenal job with this one. I'm tempted to look up if anyone posted one already. Yeah, we'll have to look for that. Um, Songwa, like I said, all the vocalists, even Jung Ho, uh, was getting in on, like, the kind of, like, rap flow in mm-hmm. parts of the song, which is really cool to see and hear. Yeah, like, um, so Yo Song and Son kind of rapping was really nice. Yeah, I was like, just hear them sing. And like, we know Songwa can rap, obviously. Jung Ho, um, I've heard him jokingly rap before, so seeing him kind of do it a little bit here was really cool, too. Um, you know, kind of has that deeper tone, so he kind of fits along the same lines as, like, Songhua, mm-hmm. where he can, he's mostly, he's a vocalist, but he kind of has that tone where he could, if he, like, stuck out, like, the way he does the melody could sound more like rapping. Um, but, like, wow. Like I said, definitely much better appreciation of the song, for sure. I really enjoy this. And I love, too, the use of auto-tune in this. Because, like I said, it's very different styling from what they've done. Like, it's not so far different that it's, like, completely removed from them and it doesn't sound like them at all. Like, it's still very 80s, but it's very different from what I'm used to hearing from them. And I like how it wasn't overdone. Yeah, like... They at least did a little bit. The auto-tune works. It works for the purpose. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it wasn't, like, just thrown in there for no reason. It wasn't, you know like, overly done, like you said, it, it had a purpose, it served that purpose, and it fit flawlessly with what they were going for, so, like I said, you know with autotune sounds like some, uh, like, yeah, California rapper. Like Hong Jun, but they didn't show who was, like, doing it, so I'm just like... Well, at the very beginning, it said it was Hong Jun, and the, or it was, it was Yoon It said Yoon Yeah, it was Yoon Yeah, to me, it sounded like Hong Jun, though. Yeah. I'm, like, during the video... And then, like, when they showed it here, I'm like, yeah, it does sound like you know. Yeah, he has a little fuller of a, vo- a voice than Hong. Hong but it was also auto tuned. So. Yeah, but it's just it's really cool to see that. Um, uh, definitely adding this to the playlist for sure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> um, anything else you want to say on this one? We've talked for quite a bit on this, but that's because we had the music video and the lyrics. I think we pretty much covered everything. Yeah, we had a little theory breakdown, we had a little lyric breakdown, um, so, um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as we did, guys. Like, seriously, go support the boys, they absolutely deserve it, they're amazing. We'll leave a link to our Patreon, Instagram, and our Twitter down below in the description box where you can come over and check us out, it really helps us so, so much. Seriously, support means the absolute, absolute world to us. Welcome to all of our new surveys, goods are seriously amazing. We love you, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye.